what makes us a Filipino. I was living in this society, can't even tell their styles and true personality. As I see bicycle and roamed around the place, I saw a plenty of people smiling with embrace. Singing to a foreign language, we can't judge them, it's a suffrage. Youths nowadays are eager to learn the other culture. I can't tell ours were under a tremendous torture. Can't even speak a direct Tagalog, knowing they are more interested in other dialogue. Even foods are slowly changing, from sinigang aninasal to kimchi and samgipsal. How about the movies? Where do youths usually watch? A Hollywood star with a hive hatch? or a BL series that often had the same match. I wonder how Filipinos out there knows the economic movies. Have you ever heard about Fernando Po or even Rico J. Pono? Why do we need to preserve our very own treasure? It's a question that we need to answer. Enlighten those youths who still have the power to change the country and to make it proper. If we do love our very own, we will show innovate and prosper as a whole. It can be economically, industrially, and environmentally. It can add a big impact on how, how we embrace our country. If you are a Filipino, speak Tagalog. When you're hungry, eat kari kari. When you're thirsty, drink boko. When you're bored, watch Filipino drama. When you want to buy new clothes, go straight to the Versaria. When you want to have snack, go find some chicharia. Filipino products are produced as the reflection of our creativity. We, the citizens, should pay some respect and value. A living prodigy that will make us a virtue. We are a Filipino, born with tan skin, a common skin that could attract foreign. We are sweet and kind, a true Filipino to be defined. And that's what makes us a Filipino. By Mary Grace Sumadero. And I thank you.